Hey YouTube, this is Fred Braun. Um, I know I haven't brought you like anything uh, super super great. My Zectors and whatever. My uh, higher addicts and whatever. But today I'm bringing you a deck that honestly I like a lot. Um, a lot of people are trying to make it right now, which I'm kind of nervous about because I don't know if I'm going to keep it, if everybody's going to make it. I'm, I'm a hipster. I'm a Yu-Gi-Oh hipster. I like having a deck somebody's not using, that kind of thing. So let's start with this. Um, I've actually had... I think today it would be, I think I've had about 15 people ask me about making this deck profile, so I figured I'd make it, so uh, I hope everybody likes this. Um, this is my Noble Knights. Um, I run mine differently than some people. Um, I like your opinions, but if you're going to be rude, don't don't say anything, because that's not necessary. But okay, let's get started. Um, I'm going to start with the non-Noble Knights. One Gores, one Black Luster. One Spirit Reaper, two Tour Guide, one Honest, and then uh, my friends bringing me the cards, but I do I'm using these are just like proxies. So and then two uh, Dino or two uh, Rabbit. Why did I say Dino Rabbit? Whatever, two Rabbits. Um, the Rabbits that's pretty easy. That's an instant overlay. Honest boost up a light monster. That's always useful. Um, tour Guide I just put in here. A lot of people see Tour Guide almost as like a win condition or like. But I see it as just like uh, save my ass for a turn. That's why I'm not really running anything else other than the two two or guys to search each other out. A save it, save my ass card. This face down is very good. Gore's another save my ass card. It's just a good card. And BLS because if I'm running lights and darks, why wouldn't I use this if I have it? Okay, now for my noble knights. Three Gwain. Gwain's great, great, great. Yeah, great. Gwain is great. Gwain is just wonderful. I love Gwain. He's uh, probably my second favorite Noble Knight overall, just by the luck of him, but he is super, super cool. Um, if you normal summon a monster, then... And it is a normal monster, so Artigus, uh, Medrat, since he is a Gemini, but he isn't considered an effect monster until you reactivate his effect. If you have him on the field, boom, special summon and defense. Great instant overlays. Then I have two Medriots. I only run two because, well, once we get to the other cards, you'll see why. I only run two Medriots just because I only think you need to. You don't really need that many. But Medriots a great card. Um, if you read Normal Summon, isn't it? He, what, becomes a Dark? So he's super, super good. I love him. I, he's my favorite overall. Then three Artigas. Um, Artigas is pretty easy to explain. He's a target for Rabbit, and he's a target for Gwain. 1800 attack beat stick. That's super good. And then the one thing that... Oh, I almost forgot. And then the two ignoble Black Knights, which I'm, I think it's funny that they're ignoble, so but whatever. Only two. You only need two. Three is too much, in my opinion. Two works. Um, if you have a normal knight, you can uh, tribute it to bring him out. So it's a good card. And then finally, the three cards that I run, just because I like this card. It's one of my favorites. Three Neos Alias. Uh, two, all three. Well, two of one rarity, one of an ulti. But, but overall, they're great. They're considered noble cards. A target for Gwen, good for overlays. Okay, next my spells. Um, these my friend's bringing me these two because he's a hero, not two Miracle Fusions. Uh, they will both be ulti. Um, but two Miracle Fusions. Miracle Fusions good, especially with this deck. A uh, light hero, a hero and a light. That's pretty easy to do with this deck. And Shining's honestly a great card. He's one of my favorite heroes. Let me uh, grab the rest of these. One Monster Reborn. That's an obvious one. I really don't need to explain. One Dark Hole. Don't need to explain. Heavy Storm for that uh, back row anxiety. Uh, Pot of Avarice. When you use this deck, you'll find that you run through cards real quick. Pot of Avarice is great. Um, one MST. The Ghost one, of course, because that's my favorite one. Um, one MST works, honestly. If you want to run three, run three. But I found that uh, with a deck like this, where you're not going to plan on OTKing, you have to plan on staying in the game for a little while. Traps over spells, honestly. A back row is good. Uh, draw power. Two power to duality. And then for the swords, honestly, everybody has their own opinion on what noble arms you should use. Um, I have a friend who's going to make the deck, and he's going to run one of each. Honestly, I only use the ones that I like, which is Alferdine, which is, eh, it, it has its pluses and minuses, but if you're going to run the uh, XYZ, that's good. Uh, Caliburn and Caliburn. Caliburn's the best one, honestly. So, 
yeah, it is just the best one. I, nobody else can argue that with me. You equipped it, your monster gains 500, and once per turn you can gain 900 life points. Honestly, like, what's better than that? So it's almost dying Kato with the effect of uh, empowering your monster. That's great. Those are the spells. Traps. One torrent. Two miracle. Or miracle. Two mirror. Two bottomless. One solemn. One solemn warning. This deck is ready for the uh, new uh, format. So as of right now, you can run two solemns if you want, but you only can one run one very soon. Okay, now for the extra deck. The extra deck, everybody has their own opinions on what you should run for an extra deck. Um, this, I haven't, uh, I've only been testing it on Def Pro and Dueling Network. It runs really well. I've beaten Mermails with it. I've beaten Insectors with it. And I've beaten uh, Chaos Dragons. I really haven't faced anything too meta with it. But it does really good other, against like Mermails and stuff, I've learned. So my extra deck, and this is exactly what I'm using on Dueling Network right now, is one Elemental Hero Shining. I uh, side one on uh, Death Pro, just in case of game two, I think he's going to be more useful. But for real life, I'm only going to use one. You only really need one. Because you don't want to depend too much on the Elemental Hero aspect of this deck, because it is Noble Knights. One Noble Knight Artitoti... Er, uh, never mind. Artigas, King of the Noble Knights. His effect's pretty good. Honestly, since you you when he's summoned, you can choose three different name ones. Two is good enough, especially with the MST. So that basically takes up the place of the uh, two MSTs you could possibly run, in my opinion. So that's really all you need, in my opinion. You don't need more. Um, if you think that you need more, please comment below and let me know what you're thinking. Um, one heroic uh, champion Excalibur. That 4,000 beat stick, honestly. If nobody has an answer to that, you're kind of fucked. Uh, for my another rank four, Gem Knight Pearl. Gem Knight Pearl's a it, honestly, it's a normal monster. It's 2600. That's stronger than most XYZs that don't take more. Well, the ones that at least take two. Once you get into Shark Drake, he's a little, he's a weak. Um, one Photon Pillar Operative or Photon Butterfly Assassin. I prefer Butterfly Assassin overall, but whatever. We're in America where we can't say Assassin apparently. Um, one Heroic Champion Gandiva. One Utopia. One Chaos Utopia. Chaos Utopia is great. One Diamond Direwolf. One Black Corn. One May Stroke. As you can clearly see, I only put monsters where you need two level fours. Um, if you want to go into the threes, if you want to go into like Shark Drake, and if you want to go into Shockmaster, that's fine. But I honestly, when I put them in this deck, I found I never used them because it's really hard to get three monsters out on the field all at once, all in one turn. Because this deck is more playable, not OTKable, so there you go. Um, for my one rank three, Zen Mine, that's really all you need. Um, I do side uh, Levier just in case for if I, you plan on using your Rabbit a lot. Honestly, with this deck, I found I don't use the Rabbit a lot. But uh, Wind Up Zen Mines is good for stall, so. And then my rank fives, ZW Leo Arms. Nothing makes you feel better than beating someone's ass with uh, Utopia equipped with this. This is great. I love that. I've used that a lot. One number 33, Chronomaly uh, Mac Machu Mac. That's a super, super good card. Uh, I, I don't know why people don't all, just all run this, honestly. With a level 5 mean deck, you might as well, might as well want to end the lined up. One wind up Zen Mo. Pop 2. That's honestly good. So technically, this deck has like, what? One, two three, four, four ways to destroy back row. That's super good. Um, other than that, this is my deck profile. Um, the uh, cards that were uh, the proxies, they will have their ac the actual cards. Those would be the two Rescue Rabbits and the two Miracle Fusions. They will be, my friends are bringing them over either later tonight or early to tomorrow. So those will be in there. Um, I'm going to test it this weekend on my locals. Um, this deck is for sale um, or trade. Uh, trade Honestly, I'm only looking for Constellars and Evil Swarms, so if you have those, uh, we can work something out for the deck. Um, if uh, Please be real with the offers. Don't come to me and offer me like a Dragoonity deck, because I'm not going to trade a Dragoonity deck for this, because this is way better than Dragoonities. Um, especially with the Diamond Dire Wolf in here, which is really wanted, the Medriots, which is really wanted, the BLS, which is really wanted right now, especially by, well, especially by everyone, basically. Um... Other than that, uh, comment, tell me how you feel about it, like if you like it. Um, please no dicks, don't be a dick about this. If you are, I will hunt you down and kill you. I'm just kidding, I'm not going to hurt anybody. But if you're a dick, I will delete the post probably. Um, other than that, please like, subscribe to my channel. Um, check out my trade binder. Um, the only things I have changed in it is I do not have Big Eye anymore. I do have two card card Ds in it instead. 
and uh, or I will be having they haven't came in the mail and then uh, Quasar is gone I will have uh, Pallades and then I also have gotten a few other uh, Constellars from my locals so other than that check out my binder please subscribe if you haven't already other than that everybody has, have a good day PM me if you have any questions peace